Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Ray, and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. I did, uh, I think I did like one or two days off camera. I really wanted to get the store level 20 today, like, and pretty early in the video. So I did some off camera work. Um, I, you know, sold a bunch of stuff, stocked a bunch of stuff. This stuff right here, I just want to bring this up to your attention if you're playing this game. This stuff is the best profit I've seen of anything that's not even close. And I'm out of it. <laughs> also, I do have a stock room back here. But the thing is, now that I have enough shelf space, I think I have enough shelf space to keep everything on the shelf for the entire day. And I, I've been in the habit of ordering extra stuff and keeping it back here. But the time it takes to put stuff back here, bring it up, put it back here, go back and forth, it feels like wasted time. I mean, I can just order stuff and then stock it and be done with it. So I'm going to try not to keep stuff in the back too much. Uh, but, you know, we'll see how that goes. All right, so we need some muscle milk. What else do we need? Um, I thought there was something over here. Oh, yeah, we need more olive oil. So I'm going to do muscle milk and olive oil. And I think two cases of that. And we'll do we'll do two cases of the, of the olive oil as well. And like I said, I'm trying not to keep the, the boxes in the back if I can avoid it. Um, but that muscle milk is super duper, like, good. Um, I got to keep it stocked. It's my number one profit that I've noticed. Maybe there's something in there that's more profit. Um, I will go through the prices today before we open the store. So I don't show you all of me going through the prices and I don't show you all of me stocking, but um, I don't know. This stuff's kind of therapeutic, so I will I will show some of it. Uh, I watch people play this game as well. And um, oh, wow, it's one for each shelf. Oh my goodness. All right, we need another one then. We need another one. I do watch other people play this game. And I do watch them stock. I don't I don't know. It's I have no better way of saying it other than I said it last time. This game is way more fun than it has any right to be. I don't understand like how they did it. I don't get it. Some people said it'd be nice if when you're stocking, if you could just hold down the button. I totally agree. You should be able to just hold down the button while stocking. Great tip. I'm sure they'll put that in the game. And there. There. Now, I do have extra unused shelf space, but I'm going to leave it alone because I am going to be purchasing a new license and I'm going to need more shelf space for the for the new items. And I don't know what I'm going to do about the, the fridges. Uh, we should probably get some milk. Do we have any milk back here? I thought I had some. I guess not. All right. That's not going to be enough milk. We're going to need milk, cereal, milk, cereal. And I think the rest of the stuff we have can get us through most of the day. So let's do milk. Milk, 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 milk. Uh, I'm also going to grab some pasta spaghetti. Uh, milk and one of each of the cereals. This one's up here. This one is down here. Okay, let's get that stuff stocked. Then we're going to start the day. Let's go through the pricing and see what's what. I'm going to ask you guys to let me know in the comments, too, if you want to, if you feel like it. What's your favorite part of watching me play this game? Do you like watching me reprice stuff? Do you do you like watching me stock? Do you like watching me ring ring people up? What, what do you like the most? Okay, so five forty to six dollars. You should probably start bringing these down. Let's do five fifty. I feel like such a tight one. People are like in the comment section, like I'd never go to your store, Cage. You charge too much. I'm like, really? Okay, uh, forty eight to five dollars is okay. Um, six. Oh, see, sometimes you're getting a deal. Well, not anymore, but sometimes. And again, that's $7. Okay, so the price of cereal is going up. That is interesting. All right, so this is way, way overpriced. Uh, so $3.23, let's go to $3.50. There we go. Did I do that right? Yes, I did. All right. Um, also, if you see a profit more than that uh, muscle milk, let me know. Um, $2.88. See, sometimes I give people good deals because I don't notice. That's that's over. The good deals are over. 11 11 04, that's fine. Um 250 to 240, that's fine. 750, perfect. I usually just round up to the next half dollar, I guess. Uh so that's 650. Oops. 50. I don't deal with dimes and nickels and pennies in this store. We do everything at 50. So if you can't get change with a quarter, then we don't do it. Oh, it was like that at the train station too. When I worked at the train station, everything was was to quarter, so I didn't have to deal with dimes and nickels. Uh, Six fifty. I think you see what we're up to here. 
There should be one button I could go on the computer and just press it and say match market price for everything in this store. I probably wouldn't use it, but it would be nice to have it. Uh, yes, that's fine. How about the tea? Yep, tea is fine. How about coffee? Coffee is fine. Uh, again, if you find this boring with the with the, I'm going through a lot of product at this point, but my feeling is that like I think a lot of people find this interesting. If you find it interesting, say so. If you find it boring, say so. You could tailor you could tailor make the videos around what you guys like. So seven, that's good. Uh, that's fine. I think our prices are pretty good. Um, yeah, four fifty. That's two dollars. That's cheap cake, man. I thought that cake was gonna be expensive. Let's go with four fifty here. And how about the orange juice? How about OJ? OJ's looking good. Apple. By the way, apple juice OJ would all be the same price. This is all from the same company. They wouldn't like. At least I think so. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure all our juices were the same in the store. Same thing with soda. Um, although I guess the market price is dependent on what people will pay, not, you know, what you, what, what kind of profit you're looking for. I'm going to leave those a little bit under market cost. I think 250 is a little much for a soda. So I'm going to leave those there. That's fine. Uh, yep, that's fine. Okay. Let's open the store. And while the store is open, I think I'm going to go ahead and buy some more coffee. And... No, maybe just coffee for now. I could probably get one of each of the pastas. So coffee, pasta, sprites. Oh, let's see if we have any in the back before we buy it. Coffee, pasta, sprite. Uh, no. No. Coffee, pasta, sprite. Coffee, pasta, sprite. Let's do it. Coffee. Maybe I could do displays. No, that's that. Okay. Um, shelf. All right, that makes it a little bit easier. Not much, but a little bit. Coffee, pasta, both pastas, and Sprite. That's in it. Yeah, never mind. Uh, soda. There we go. All right, I'm also gonna take a look at my bills. I I don't remember looking at for the. <laughs> I haven't. I don't remember looking at my bills any time. Recently, there we go. Pay, pay, pay. Yep, we're doing okay with our bills. Cool. Um, let's take a look at our um, our license too, because I don't remember. Wait, license is in here. My bad. License. There we go. I don't remember which. Okay, so we're gonna buy this one. Yeah, we're gonna buy. We'll just buy one for now, because if you the thing is, if you start buying multiple licenses, even though you can exp, you can you can afford them, it doesn't. It's not that good because then people will like see if you have bleach cleaner dishwasher tablet like all this stuff you have all this stuff stocked and then you buy this and none of this stuff is stocked you're going to get negative reactions from that so um yeah just remember that my guy was seriously running behind so i had to hop on a register but that is okay it looks like we're uh we're doing pretty good here the night is almost over i don't think i ran out of any stock let's go take a look uh no it all looks um i mean it's slow but Nothing's out as far as I can tell. Yeah, no. Everything looks good. We just got to keep stocking. Keep stocking. Keep stocking. Got to get this bread stocked. There we go. And put that right there. And what about you? All right. So we got this candy stuff. The candy aisle is hot. Everybody loves it. Everybody loves the candy aisle. Got some cakes. Beautiful. I wonder if you could sell diet food in this game. That'd be pretty cool to have like a diet section or something. People like want like groceries but don't want to buy like all the, you know, the junk food or whatever. I mean, I guess like flour and everything is like they're cooking at home and maybe you can make something. I don't know. What do you make with flour? I'm not a, I'm not a cook. I'm not a cook. What do you guys, what do you guys use flour for? I don't know. Go. Beautiful. Gonna stock one more, then we'll finish up the day. And tomorrow we're getting another uh, another cashier, and then we're gonna save up for uh, expansion of the of the um, the store. Let's see what the expansion costs. I mean, we might be able to do them at the same time. Let's take a look. Probably not, cause we need more furniture and stuff. But growth. Yeah, I thought it was that expensive. I mean, that's not that's not ridiculous. Um, 
But the thing is, I, I think I'd want to get these two together because right now, if you if you expand it, it'll be a four by four, and then it would just be like one, like it wouldn't be this whole wall being pushed back or that whole wall being pushed back. It'd be half of it, I think. So I'm gonna save those. I'm gonna save up for those um, one after the other. I know it's gonna be expensive, but I think we can do it. Uh, let's go ahead and hi oh, complete checkouts. Wait, is that personal checkouts? It's gotta be personal checkouts. Do I really have to check people out myself? Maybe it's not personal checkouts. I'm not really sure. I mean, it feels like it is. But, damn. It, like, I, if I have to check people out myself to get the freaking hiring option, that'd be kind of weird. All right, let's finish the day. And look at that. Only three people found expensive items. We made still, 1500 I could have swear I was making over $2,000 a couple days, but I don't know. That's fine, I guess. All right, so do I want... Here's the thing. You know what? Let's go ahead and open. I want to see if he counts. Right now we're at 349. Let's um let's just start stocking and um we're going to let him do his thing. So bread bread muscle milk. I also I, you know what? I'm just going to get one of every now. Well, see the thing is I don't need these two sodas. You know what? Let's stock what we have in here first and I'm about, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at the stuff I don't need. And I'm going to say, don't get that. And then I'm going to say, get one of everything else. I think that might be a good way to go. Yeah. This freaking water isn't selling that good. I mean, I don't, I don't buy bottled water either. I get it out of my, uh, my refrigerator. So maybe that's what it's all about. We can definitely stock these juices, though. Beautiful. Stock the juices. Probably going to need more of those pretty soon. Oops. Throw that away. The other juice. Oops. That freaking door, man. I always get caught on it. You know what? When Autumn is playing, she gets caught on it as well. Do you guys get caught on that door a lot? That's another thing. When you put boxes in here, you don't know how many are in there. You think you have a full box and you got like three. You know? So, yeah, I really don't want to keep boxes. If I do, I don't want to, I don't want to rely on them. I don't, I don't want to have more than a few pieces in each box so I know that, okay, there's only a few pieces in that box. I don't keep whole boxes anymore. It'll make, it'll make things a lot easier. All right, so he has definitely rung someone up. Let's go see if that thing has changed. I don't think it has. I think I have to ring them up. Yep. That's personal checkouts. Oh, man, that... that. Uh, so I have to check people out myself to be able to hire cashiers? I don't... I don't... I don't like that. That needs to be taken out. <laughs> the whole point of me getting freaking cashiers is so I don't have to ring people up myself. Yeah, that needs to be taken out. Damn it. All right. Let me get stocked. Let me start ringing people up myself. Uh, am I the boss or am I the boss? I guess I'm not the boss. I guess I'm the chump. I spent the whole day stocking. I didn't get any chance to ring anybody up. I think I'm going to... I think this guy will get packed up with this machine. I might just ring people up myself all day tomorrow. That's that's tomorrow's order, order by the way. Let's take a look here. Management, yeah, see, 349 to 400. Okay. I think tomorrow I'm going to crack my knuckles. There we go. Actually, I don't think you get 40, I don't think you get 50 people per day. So I might have to do two days of cashier duty. Uh, we'll have to see how that goes. Uh, I am going to have to stock before I open up, though. Uh, I've got a whole order coming. I almost ran out of stuff today, but I don't think I've ran out of anything. Although I'm not really sure. We need um, rice. Uh, we need this candy, and I've got everything else on order. So we'll see how this goes. Um, I accidentally ordered another thing of water. Ugh. Maybe I should just drop the water prices. You know? Just to get rid of the, get rid of it. I mean, I can't drop it that much more. It's two freaking 49 over 250 Let's see how it sells tomorrow. Maybe it went up in price yesterday or something. <clears throat> or I wasn't paying attention to what. It did go up in price. Let's take a look at the market. You should be able to just filter by, like, what has changed in price. Great, huh? Okay. All right, so I'm not seeing anything, any arrows there. No arrows there. No arrows. No arrows. So soda went up. And I didn't see any more arrows, but I could have missed them. All right, let's finish the day and see how, see how we did. Oh, okay, so that's not too bad. That's not too bad. It's going to take me two more days, though, to get the, you know ringing up and stuff 
So it is what it is. Let's go ahead and do this order. Purchase. And let's put all this stuff away. See, when you only have stuff out on the shelves, it really puts you in danger of running out of things. And I'm probably going to run out of stuff. Like, honestly, with the amount of stuff people buy, I might actually run out of stuff today if I'm not stocking. And I'm not going to be stocking. So we will see how that goes. But... Okay, so we've got a box of cheese here. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. I've got a few stuff in the back. A few things in the back isn't that big of a deal. Um, spaghetti. I always order the pasta together. Like, if I order one pasta, I order another. I always order the same amount. They seem to sell at the same clip, too, so... That's interesting. Got some eggs down there. I don't think I'll order any more eggs for today. We've got peanut butter. I'm going to move for peanut butter and jelly. We have to get some of that at the store next week. We don't go to the store. I don't go to the... Oh, actually, Autumn is going out. Maybe I can never get some. We'll see. She's already got a lot of stuff to get, so... This game's making me hungry for peanut butter and jelly. You hear me, baby? Yeah, I did. You going to give me some peanut butter and jelly today? <laughs> Do we have any peanut butter or jelly? We have peanut butter. Uh, I think I should... Did you check the, j the date on the peanut no, butter? No, I didn't. Okay. But we bought it when we moved here. So. Okay. All right. Uh, let me let me finish up and I'll, I'll come out in a minute. All right. So there we go. Looking good. All right. Let's see what else we need here. Um, that stuff looks okay. That looks probably okay. Hmm. I might I might. St well, this stuff isn't selling that much anymore. I wonder if it went down in price. No. I might get some of that. Yeah, let's get some more of that. I don't want to run out of that stuff. That's my biggest profit, and it's not even close. Uh, that stuff looks good. We should get blue um, blue flour. Blue flour, rice, one of each pasta. Blue flour. Blue flour. Um, that's at the top or the bottom? I don't remember. Yeah, blue flour, rice, one of each pasta. 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 Rice. All right, let's see what else we got here. Um, yeah, it should be okay. Uh, yeah, that's all right. Oh yeah, candy. Um, two of the blue candy. One of the I don't even know what these are. So two of the blue candy. Um, one of the other candy. Oh my goodness, so much. Definitely gonna run out of some stuff, I think, but eh, it should be okay. Carry hold, box up. I can't believe I just box this guy up. Now, actually, he might he might come back with the other one. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, open. Yeah, so he, he comes in with this one. I, w I don't think I can get rid of him without firing him, and I, I don't want to fire him. I don't, think it, I don't think it matters, though. Well, I have to pay $100 to hire him again. But, yeah, I really don't want to fire him. Will he be in this one? Damn it. I wonder if I could put him in a position where nobody can get to him, and then maybe I can do it that way. Because he's got to be in here. Like, there's no... I can't... No, see. The people are going to be able to get to him no matter what. Yeah, they're going to be able to get to him no matter what. Damn it! So I'd actually have to fire him. I think I'm going to fire him because, it, like, it's going to take me multiple days if I don't. So, it is what it is. I can always rehire him. So, let's just go ahead. I'm bugged. I think I remember someone else having this bug. They can't do anything. Save the game, at least. Yeah, I can't put that down. I'm not sure. I'm pressing all the buttons, so I'm just gonna reload. I'm gonna fire him, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll rehire him when I've done enough checking out myself. I mean, I could just check out with him, but that could take multiple days. I only get about 35 customers a day, so like, I don't need to be splitting that with him. Oh boy. At least these people are spending some money. I gotta work on the lights in here too. I keep saying I'm going to, and I keep forgetting. Go ring all that up. They're probably like, I'm glad that other guy is in here. He's freaking slow. And I'm like, yeah. I wonder if at some point if I can get self-checkout machines. But then I probably don't have to worry about people stealing. I think um, they're definitely going to add shoplifting into the game at some point. I think I remember reading that somewhere. So. It'd be cool if I got caught the shop the shoplifter, if I could beat him to death. <laughs> I guess and then I go to jail, but, you know, it would be a pretty fun episode. 
<laughs> shopkeeper goes to jail for beating shoplifter. I don't know, maybe, you know, I might get away with it. Well, maybe not to death. Put him in a hospital. Right, there we go. You know what there'd be a lot less of if shoplifters are getting beat to death? Shoplifters. But, to be fair, to be fair, um, it might be a little harsh. It might be a little harsh. So, alright. No, no being shoplifters to death. That's, that's fine. Uh, I just want to get them and press charges. Unless it's a kid. I might let a kid get away with it. Depends on, you know, if he's just a good kid, he's just acting out, or if he's like a bad kid, maybe he needs some time in juvie. I don't know. I feel like if kids go to juvie, it's just, they come out worse. <laughs> And I'm speaking from no experience whatsoever. All right, there we go. We're up to six thousand dollars. Let's see how we did. Uh, first of all, before we do anything, let's come here. Yeah, three eighty nine. So one more day. I could probably check out with the other guy. I'm gonna just check out by myself so I can work towards cashier three. Let's do one more day of that and let's um do this. And look at that. Look at that. Still fifteen hundred dollars, but that's okay. That's okay. Rice has gone down oh man nobody likes rice all right let's just go with six dollars on that well it's been a lot of work but i think i'm gonna be able to hire that second person tomorrow Dada. and at that point i think my next step is to um purchase a license so i can have more things and then the next step after that is to save a bunch of money for the the store expansion I will not be expanding it one store expansion at a time. I'm going to do two at a time so the, the the building stays square, you know, instead of having weird expansion angles and stuff. If you guys watched when I expanded the first time, I expanded once and only half the wall got expanded. So it was kind of kind of awkward. And I'm, I'm making, like, a lot of money at this point. <laughs> like, I could probably, I mean... Uh, cheese is too expensive. I haven't gone over the prices in a while. I need to look through the prices again. Uh, 78. We should just be just about done here. I don't, think any, I don't think anything ran out. So my idea of, you know, only ordering what I need and not having boxes in the back, it's working out pretty good. There's a couple boxes back there. Every once in a while, I'm going to have one thing that's going to overflow and I got to put a box back there. But there's only like two or three boxes back there. Go take a look. Yeah, four boxes. Not including the other register. All right, come on, guys. Closing time. Buy everything. Buy me Bone Storm or go to hell. Who can tell me what that's from in the comments? Oh, yeah, okay. Going out with a bang here. Uh, 50 cents. I love it. And come on, lady. Let's go. Get your candies, your chocolate candies. And let's get going. You should get chocolate candies, you think? There's a few things back there, but not too many. So she's getting chocolate candies and cheese. That's a weird combination. Um, oh, no chocolate candies? Oh, she got the other candy. Okay, I see. All right. Oh, what a way to end it. 69. Awesome. All right, let's see right here. And I probably won't restock because I just want to do the next day. Um, so higher and higher. And that cost me $100 because I fired him. But that's okay. I'm okay with that. Let's go ahead and put the other one down. Like I said, I'm not going to... I don't care if people don't get what they want tomorrow. Um, I'm, I just want to watch these two people work. Okay. It's pretty good to me. All right. Uh, the stock is not great, but it's also not terrible. I've seen much worse. Let's go ahead and end the day. And only five unhappy customers. going to be a lot more unhappy customers today, but that's it. You know, what are you going to do? All right. Let's open up. And let's see how this goes.
Alrighty, and there we go. We're up to $8,600. Although the shelves, well, this, these shelves don't look too bad. Those don't look too bad. These, okay, so I ran out of red flour. I ran out of the muscle milk. Um, was something here? Crap, I don't remember. <laughs> I'm pretty sure something was here and I ran out of it. Uh, coffee and tea did not run out. This stuff didn't run out. Um, one of the candies ran out. Honestly, not as much stuff ran out as I thought it was going to. That wasn't too bad. Let's go ahead and finish the day and see how that went. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad, considering I didn't stock anything. There you go. Awesome. So, next episode. I still have to ring up. I have to ring up. Five, six, seven, eight, five hundred, almost, what, 470 people? To get a cashier three, that's, they got to change that. I should not be ringing up anybody at this point. Um, so anyway, next up, oh, bills. I totally forgot about bills. There we go. Cool. So next episode, I think we're going to go with the growth. We're going to open up the store. Uh, it's five, it's no more than eight. So, eh, maybe, maybe we'll hold off on that. That will put us down, um, pretty low. Uh, not, we won't run out of money, but don't forget, I have to restock the store. And plus, like, I don't want to do the growth without saving up, a, like, a couple thousand dollars for shelving and, you know, freezers and fridges and stuff like that. I think next episode we're going to do the license. We'll do the um, product license here, and we will be stocking it. Actually, you know what? Boom. Okay, so now I have new stuff I can sell. Awesome. Yep. Toilet paper, shampoo, hand soap, bleach, cleaner, dish. Okay, so six more items. All right, that's not too bad. I should have room for all that stuff. All right, guys, I'm going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.